So hi guys. So today I'm gonna show you guys how to whenever you play build a boat for treasure, always get to the end. The first method I'm showing you, I guarantee that you're gonna do it. So you can so well you can get a motor and like put it behind the boat and like when you do that you're pretty expensive now the first boat I'm gonna show you it doesn't have a thing but this boat as you can see is really thick and look it has like different layers and it has different layers and like you can see that it helps it not like get destructed so you don't want to use wood of course you want to use something like metal like see metal don't there's like metal and stone that's the most that's like what you you want to do okay this is person who is this person So, so that person is flying. He can't even stop when he wants to. Look at him. Now he's coming back. Look at how fast he is. And so I guarantee you that that always go to goes to the end this other boat it has a motor so you can like move around where you want you can like move around so so this is what happens. at the end you're gonna see that I covered the motors and you have to see the red balls. I didn't realize, but I was going backwards. And then I look at my map, and I see I'm going downwards. So then I make a U-turn. So now you can like maneuver your way. See, like, um, okay, don't mind that. You can like kind of move your way through it. So see. I can go through these cracks. Don't mind that. I'm not the worst best driver, but I'm not the worst. You you can probably drive better than me, and if you can, you're probably gonna win. So so you can see how I maneuver my way through. It's pretty easy to do this. When you're in a boat, um, it's really easy to do this. Just see this. My boat is, um, no mind that. This is a really hard level. There's like rocks everywhere, but I still maneuver my way through. So, so as you can see. If I was, if I was like in a boat that wasn't moving at all, was just going as the water was pushing it, I would have been like destroyed already. My driving is pretty bad right now, but just hang with me. So, okay. Um. Not saying that it's gonna make you all get you all the way there, but over here, you might just want to skip this part because I'm trying to add a motor and it doesn't work, so you can just skip this part. It's kind of gonna be a waste of your time.
it's not work, gonna work, so you can just skip. Skip. Now I'm trying to put a motor here, but it's not gonna work because this is a way too heavy boat, and the motor won't be able. One motor won't be able to push it all the way, and I actually put that boat backwards. So I saved it. I did everything. And then when I tried to test it, it did not work. So instead of me wasting your time, just skip like a few minutes. Now all the way to the end, like skip a few minutes. Until you see this boat is out up here, just skip to there. I don't know exactly when where you should skip, so just skip. I'm not even going to talk. I tried to cover this thing and that doesn't work and when I that doesn't work when you cover it that does not work and even when it's not covered this is a way too big of a boat so it won't work in that either just skip until this boat is out of here I'm not gonna talk anymore You might just cliff up, take off if I didn't talk. I don't even know what to say because I am embarrassed at myself. After I did this, I was like, if I knew anything, if I knew anything, I knew that that one motor won't be able to take this whole like 50 million ton boat that single motor won't be able to take that whole boat and I thought it would this is when I realized that this is when I realized that it doesn't work so you just want to like go in the center of it and now this is when I realized that I made it back and I was pretty embarrassed of myself. I covered it so I don't even know if it's moving. And when it wasn't covered, I saw it was moving but it couldn't move the whole boat. So I realized it. I uncovered it. I tried to do it again. And it didn't work. I was so mad at myself. I was, I was so mad. I was so mad. And then here's when I realized it doesn't work. It doesn't work. It just doesn't work. Oh. So bad. Mm. I saw that it was moving. This is when I check if it's moving. And it is. I was just not even pressing it, thinking that I was. And here is where I thought it was moving. And I'm not. I'm not moving it. So I get pretty embarrassed at myself. Well, these motors are pretty expensive. Now here, it's when I like cover this and it does work. I, it does work. You can put like a barrier, like, like metal outside it. Just make sure to not make it really heavy. That's the only thing you don't want to do. So I covered this, at first I thought it wasn't working, 
and then I realized it was. So, at first it doesn't work, and then it starts working. This time I make sure to not go the wrong way. So, I don't guarantee you this one will make it, but the really big one will. Because it has so many layers, it's made out of metal and stone, it has to work. I reset in my character because I knew it's going to take a long time. So, well, I don't know. I was just like, um, I don't know what I was doing here. Oh, yeah. So, you can like make like a normal base thing. And have a jetpack to save you from that. So that's one way. So here I'm just looking at how expensive these things are. That's motor. One of them are 450. There's a chance you get it from the um from chest, but I got this chest um jetpack from from buying it. I only got I got the um, what do you call it? The motor from a chest. You can get it. These are pretty expensive things. They are pretty good things as well. I don't know why 100. I don't know why 100 wood is 50 Robux, but I guess it is. So that's gonna be it. That's gonna be all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed and have a good time. Skip until then.